Uh, you wanted to, yeah, uh, we had talked about Salco mm -hmm. yesterday. I think you mentioned that uh, there were a th few things more that you wanted to say mm -hmm. about that uh, uh, relationship mm -hmm. in terms of perspective at Nuremberg. Mm -hmm. No, I, yes, I, uh, uh, for me personally, it's of some importance that uh, I am um, contradicting uh, the opinion of uh, me or Smith or Mars as a German historian, who are collecting many points of against my attitude in Nuremberg trial. Uh, first of all, they are saying that I have. I was cooperating, collaborating with the prosecution. Yeah? And of course, they, they think this is a very big uh, uh, reproach. And that my uh, lower sentence of 20 years is uh, due to this collaboration with the prosecution. They are saying that. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, and uh, now you were in the prosecution and you should have heard something about such uh, contacts, you know. And I didn't hear anything. No, of course not, because you weren't there. But uh, I, uh, as I, I, I confess frankly that if we could have helped the general ideas, the ideals of the Nuremberg trial uh, to, to have some connection with, uh, with uh, with the prosecution, I would have done it. But nobody asked me, of course, to do it. Mm -hmm. And uh, it could have been, for the prosecution, it could have been a very low a low point when they would have asked me to help them. Yeah. <laughs> of course, in, right. in, impossible. Right. Yeah. Right. And uh, uh, there is only one thing I cleared, uh, I found this letter. I wrote once a letter to Jackson. I wrote a letter to Jackson, and this was when there were rumors distributed among the defendants that uh, if there is anything going, if they, if they make obstruction in the trial or something like that, then the trial will be stopped and all the defendants will be handed to the Russian. It was a real a threat, you know. I don't know if the threat was an official one or not, I can't tell. And, uh, but in my low position, I took it serious and I had in the, uh, from May to October or what, when I came to Nuremberg, in those months I had uh, many uh, intensive talks with uh, leading people of your military, of the general staffs and of the, of the bombing command and so, and uh, you know, uh, among them were George Ball and Nietzsche and Wahlpreis, as important people. And uh, with all these questions and answers, I had quite an insight uh, what uh, is the goals for a faster future of the American armed forces shall be. And also uh, there were my uh, fellow, uh, also my, my, the people who have on important posts had worked with me in the armaments process and mainly in the development of new arms. They were asked too from experts of the, of the American side and of course they told reason what they were asked. And I had from this, I had a clear picture uh, what you are, in what line you are going for the future. Because only what interests, and it were open talks, you know, so I think. And so I wrote to, to uh, Jackson that um, uh, there is a danger if I am handed to the Russians that the Russians will try to get out of me my knowledge about what the Americans and British try for the future in the, in the field of armaments. And uh, 
that I am feeling not strong enough to resist this thing, you know, this torturing and all those things, and that he should give me, in this case, a chance to to go off, I said, not to go off, to, 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 to kill myself, which it was not so clearly that, but it was ideal, you know, um, because I didn't want to uh, to work, I had worked with seriousness and with uh, uh, with uh, honesty with uh, Western powers in those questions, mainly uh, also what he was concerned with the Japanese uh, deal. And uh, I didn't want now to go to the Russian and do the same for the Russian. Yes. And so that's why what I asked. That was a letter, but I never got, got an answer to it. Uh, and this letter is. Uh, is um, it's more or less a proof that I didn't work together with American and British in, in, in um, collaborating, collab collaborating in, the in, in the prosecution. Well, this is one point. And um, the second is then they are saying that I was well looking and Sauge was bad looking and, <laughs> and that. Uh, I impressed, uh, I impressed uh, uh, the churches by my good manners and by the way I handled the whole thing and also my last words, which you, by the way, you said once they were yes. impressive for you, uh, were just done to, to, uh, to give me some polish and that, uh, that I, well, let's say so, but maybe said I bribed I bribed the churches by my behavior, you know. Right. Uh, yes. And uh, now it's ridiculous because you know that those churches were really experts, like Lord Lawrence and others too. I don't know what was with Spittle, but the others I think mainly the French were also uh, really good churches, and uh, it would be uh, <laughs> for a church it would be. In any case, it would be really a uh, sign of his inability if he could be bribed by, by the behavior of, <laughs> of, uh, of a defendant. It's of course, it's impossible to think about such a thing. Yeah. But it was but, said. But, but as you know, there was there were really, really some sympathy between uh, from the side of the prosecution too, sometimes. Uh, one of us came to me at, at the bench and said, uh, and had a few nice words with me, 